Oh. Um. Yeah, you're bad news, aren't you? I can tell already. You're just bad news. Are you? Are you? I suppose I could. Yeah. Okay. Oh, okay. All right. Churchill, just, 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 just hold a minute. Hold. They'll chill out. We will. There you go. All nice and relaxed now. You just chill, just chill. Oh no. Oh! I took his head clean off. Churchill, calm down. Let me deal, please. Um. Hello? Where did you go? Uh, ah! That, oh no. I mean. Did I miss? I think I missed. God bless it, Bobby. Madam! Show your face. There you are. Kablam! Took your head clean off. Come on, Churchill. Let's just, just be careful here, Bobby. Okay. This is kind of interesting. Whoop! There's nothing. There's nobody here. Not a soul. Nothing. It's the chems. Hmm. I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna go up here. Peep. Oh my God. We've got a good view here. Um. All right. Hey, look at this. Bam. Shotgun shells. Yep. Yeah. Hideous mask. How do you even see out of that? <sighs> bunch of weirdos. Bunch of weirdos. Okay. Burnt comic shadeless lamp. No, thank you. Ooh, a yellow plate. Really? That's all that's in that metal box. Is that for real? A few beer bottles. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Well, let's have a little. Can I peep over? Somehow. Up. Up. Hmm. I know there are people in there, but I don't know where they are. Right. Well, I'll mosey on back down. Can't see them. Ah. Churchill, where are you? You all right? What are you? What are you doing? Whatever you're doing. It's carry it's, on. Ooh, okay. What the fuck was that? It was nothing. It was nothing. It was nothing. There was nobody. There was nothing. Who? Nothing. There was nothing. Not a soul. Not a soul came here. Ah, getting shook up over nothing. There you go. Chems, mate. Chems. That's why I don't do them, you know? Messes with your head. Or takes your head off, in this case. Hey! Bam! Slamming it. There are a lot of houses here. Oh! Looked like it really hurt no that. Way. Oh, you do. You. Oh, it's a ledger. God bless it. Bloody ledger. Churchill, be aware. There's a, a lunatic down there. Oh. Oh, I bloody missed. God bless it. <sighs> she had to just move her head, didn't she? The, the, the... Okay, that, that time I didn't miss. I mean... Okay. Churchill, just, just, just be aware, mate. All right. Okay. This is, this is no good. Churchill, can you... Okay, this is this is definitely not good. Ouch! Did I kill her? Killed her. Hey, brilliant. Right. Okay, let me just um. Hmm. What is the deal with the apple sauce? I'm gonna eat it. Okay. Well, it did something. It did. It did something. Churchill. 
Okay, let's have a look here. What's she got? Anything good? Uh, okay, so rounds, rounds, rounds. Marvellous. Plasma-infused calibrated 9mm pistol. It is... Do you know what? Can I... Yeah. What we'll do is we'll dump something with her that I don't want. Um... Why do I have two ornamental swords? Why do I have any? I know I liked them, but good God. No point carrying them around, is there? Uh, tactical converted crude rifle? There. All right. So, were they just like camping out here or something? Damn. Most of cocktail Mars. Well, thank you very much, sir, for your... Um, Contribution to the Royal Coffers. It's very much appreciated. Take its shells. Yeah. So, what is this place? Some kind of... Okay. Trashed shops. Oh, it says it's open. Trashed shops. Oh, Churchill... Sh um. Just, just... Oh! <sighs> Never been so nervous. Should we have a look in the trashed shops, Churchill? <sighs> no, we have a job to do. We have a job to do, and we are going to do it. So, I need to go to the police station, which is apparently this way. So, let's go. No more distractions! It's ridiculous. We can check out the trashed shops at a later date. For now, Churchill, let's, um, let's continue onwards. Is there anybody through here? Hmm. Fresh, fresh kill, fresh grill. It sounds a little threatening, doesn't it? Ooh, a stop. Oh, might there be something in here? Useful, maybe? Okay. Oh, a little bit. Little, little tiny adjustment. Hey, look at that. Hello? No fracking way. Yes. Oh. Well, that's mildly irritating, isn't it? Never mind. Teaser. Yes, I've got some cans of teaser, I believe. I must sell them on. To the highest bidder. Okay. Huh. It's very quiet, Churchill. I don't like it, buddy. Something's off. Something's way off. Oh, the police station's over there? All right. Do we maybe have to... Can't climb over this. Okay. Churchill, come on. Maybe we have to go back the other way. Retrace our steps. Yep, here we go. Alright, let's just, just be careful. Because... Anything on any what Anyone could be about... Hmm. All right. Well, look at this. Bloody hell. Do you know, I kind of like that. I kind of like that building, and I don't know why. I just like the look of it. Kind of has like the oldie worldy with the newy, newy worldy. I don't know. Lewisham, here we are, here we are, folks. Oh! oh. Churchill, Churchill. Oh, Jesus, Churchill, please get over here! Oh, no. They've spotted the dog. God bless it, Barbie. You know, Churchill, you do us no favours, mate. 
Why don't you just die instead? Hey, why not do the world that favour? Alright. Let's, let's, can we, can we peep around the... Disappearing actor. Yeah. Where the hell? Get off, get off. Where the hell? Okay, lots of rads. Why are there all those rads? Why are there all those rads? What the hell? Okay. Hey, are, mate. Get out. Are you alright, Churchill? Bloody hell. What's with all the rads, man? Jeez. Okay, alright. I better, I better, I better sort this out. This is madness. Okay, let's um. Hmm. <sighs> Just thinking, thinking. I'm gonna. Might as well eat the rad rat meat. Take some rad away. Take some rad X. There you go. So that should kind of sort us out. Churchill, my God, are you all right? Bloody hell! So, what is, what, what is the you deal? I could do this sort of act, huh? Oh, shut up! You are ridiculous. Um, all right, let's just, just, just. So, is there somebody up there? Fucking hiding from me! You're dead. I didn't hide from you. Okay, all right. All right. Do you know what? We can all do things like that. Okay, the Lejo has mutated. And now the Lejo is dead. Might as well, might as well use a stim pack, reload. Get ourselves in a decent position. Okay, so what's what's the deal with the... Where does the rads come from? Okay, so rounds... Um, cryogenic combat left arm. 10% chance to freeze melee attackers once every 20 seconds. Ah, don't really do all that. So, I heard a turret. Did hear a turret. Just going to... Around the corner. Oh, there you go. Hello. Oh, I need to reload. God Just bless it. Die. Oh, why don't you? Why is it always me that has to do the dying? Why can't it be you? You scum. You absolute scum. Peep, peep. Okay. Did I? Did he? Oh, okay. I see you. Oh, right in the head. Damn. Took you out, brother. Come on, Let's, do this. Let's not. Let's just not. It must be the weapon he's using. Just releasing some reds. Yeah. Really? Now they've mutated. Is this real life? Um. Just had to play here, huh? Wonder if my. Where's my other? Okay. My other. Rifle. Uh, let's have a look. My night vision rifle. I do. G hmm. The recon crude rifle. That's usually quite. Okay, no. That's usually not quite. Never mind. Do you suppose. Does this thing... Do Do you have to... No. No. Missing the required ammo. Never mind. Never mind. I was just curious. I will obviously have to get some ammo for that. Um, while, uh, while I'm here... Um, pig rat scratchings. Ugh. It literally sounds awful. Give me those. I'll have some rush of these too. You need to calm down, dude. You better be worth it. Blood in my eyes. 
it is, it's the weapon that he or she is using. I think it's a woman, actually. Okay, they're nearly dead. They're nearly dead. It's just, um... This is not ideal. Uh, could have some purified water. Let's just sort ourselves out. Alright. These, yep. Yeah. Okay. And so have you. There you go. And now you're dead. Good. Bloody hell. Where's this turret? I can hear it rattling around. Look at, oh. Like a cow in Switzerland. Are you alright, Churchill? You just stay there, mate. You've actually done very well by staying where you are. Good! Perfection! We freaking did it, baby. Bam! Alright. So. Yep. Tickets, rounds. Yeah. Ooh, hello. Tickets. Hello? Instigating radium rifle. That's what this idiot was using, wasn't it? Um, it's pretty good, actually. It is pretty good. Um, does double damage if the target is at full health. Holy! That's good. We are now a little over encumbered, though. Uh, what could I leave with this individual? Do you know I don't use the frigid board? And it is slow. Ah, uh, yeah, screw it. Mighty Zap Machine Pistol. I don't really use that, to be honest. Um, <sighs> good God. Hmm. What have I got by way? You can have the bloody long johns. I don't want those. What am I carrying that for? Bloody long johns. Ooh, I don't want somebody's long johns in here. You know what? We'll be fine. Come on, Churchill. Let's be be careful. Be cautious. Is there somebody up here? Where are you? Bishop's Toe. That doesn't sound like an inviting place to me, personally. It sounds rather um, weird. All right, Churchill. Okay, so I'm assuming is this this is kind of fancy windows. The bishop's toe. Um, let's have a quick peep. Just a just a quick peep. What was that? Who's that? You're dead. Okay, didn't expect that. Didn't expect that at all. Um, okay. Okay. All right, that was that was a little stupid, but you know what? I'm all right. Oh yeah, I'm still alive. Jeez, I don't know how I'm still alive. Okay, I'm really glad of this pistol. I am going to have to get some more ammunition for it, I think, purely because it's bloody brilliant. Churchill, you all right, mate? Um not going to lie, didn't really expect all this to be going on. But never mind, we're alive, we're okay. Uh, but I had that steak. Oh, shut up. No one cares, mate. I don't give a damn. Shut up. I'm coming to blow your head off now. Where are you, you creep? What a weirdo, what a weirdo. Dude. Are you up here? I know you're here. I know you're here. There you go. How'd you feel? God in heaven. Everywhere we bloody well go, people just want to kill us all the bloody time, Churchill. It's ridiculous. Bishop's Toast Staff Terminal. Hey, we could have a bath. Maybe not. 
might not be a might not be a, a good idea. It's probably radiated water, isn't it? And um, yeah, I'm likely to grow a third arm or some other ridiculous appendage. Okay, we'll have a look at the terminal in a minute. Let's just have a little butcher's hook around here. Toilets, smash mirrors. Can't even look at my beautiful face. Never mind. Nothing in here. No. Nothing. Wow. Well, mildly disappointed, but do you know what? Whatever. Whatever. Wine glass. Um, take the wonder glue. Till. What? 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 Whiskey glasses. I don't need glasses. What do I need glasses for? Empty spray cans. Empty till. Agility coaster. Ooh! Never be afraid to dodge the sensitive issues. Your agility has been permanently increased by one. Marvellous. Awesome. Lovely. I heard through the grapevine, Churchill, seeing coasters here, that there may be one at the Cyber Fox, which I would be quite keen to get. Coffee, gramophone, tickets. Oh, they killed the trader. I mean, that's kind of mean. The traders are just trying to trade. Traders gonna trade like haters gonna hate. Traders gotta trade. There you go. Oh! Terribly sorry, sir. Is that milk? Did I see milk there? Can I take the... Oh, no, it's dirty water. But do you know what? I'll take it anyway. Nuka-Cola. Martini glass. Mm. Not planning on going to any cocktail parties anytime soon, Churchill. Sadly... All it is is death and destruction these days. It's very disappointing. Oh, there's a basement? What? Okay. Um, hmm. Churchill, I, I don't think we want to be in here, mate. Just, just put... All right, let's have a look at this terminal and just see what is going on. And then we really must head to the police station, Churchill. Do the job we came to do. Bishop's Toe Staff Terminal. Okay. Ooh, Terminal Entry 1. Date uh, the 1st of September 2077. Okay. The European Civil War has turned Bishop's Toe into a battleground of its own kind. With rationing hitting hard, folks can barely afford a sip, let alone a pint. The pub used to be packed with laughter and chatter. But now it's quieter than a convict in hiding. Operating costs are higher than ever, and I'm struggling to keep this taps flowing. Got to find a way to weather this storm. Entry by owner Bowen Landeg. Okay. Um, entry 2, 9th of September 2077. Pouring hope. It's tough behind the bar these days. Rationing's made every penny count, and customers can't splurge on a night out like before. But we're holding on, trying to keep the spirit alive. Reducing portions, simpler drinks, anything to keep the regulars coming back. People might not have much, but they still need a place to unwind. If we can make it through this war, we can make it through anything. Entry by Bartender Lucy. Okay, she was optimistic. 20th of September 2077. Adapting the menu. Cooking's become a challenge in itself. With supplies scarce and prices skyrocketing, we've had to get creative with the menu. Gone are the days of elaborate dishes. Now it's about making the most of what we have. New stews and preserved veggies are the norm, and customers are surprisingly receptive. Bishop's Toe might be a pub, but it's also a refuge from the chaos outside. Entry by owner Bowen Landeg again. Okay. Cautiously optimistic by the sounds of it. Uh, 21st of September 2077. A loyal few. The crowd might be thinner, but the loyalty remains strong. Some of our regulars still manage to scrape together enough money to visit us. They might not stay as long or order as much, but their familiar faces remind me why Bishop's Toe matters. It's more than just a pub. It's a community, a slice of normalcy amidst the madness. Here's hoping the war ends soon and we can get back to the way things were. Entry by owner Bowen Landeg. Ha! Huh. Cautiously optimistic for sure. 12th of October 2077. Brighter days ahead. Writing this entry with a glimmer of hope. The European Civil War has taken its toll, but Bishop's Toe is still standing. Slowly but surely, things are starting to look up. Rationing isn't easing, and people are cautiously coming back. 
but loyalty to our pub is strong. With some smart and savvy behind the scenes decisions, I've worked a way out that we can cut costs, which means we'll make it through the darkest days, and while the operating costs are still a challenge, the spirit of the pub remains unbroken. Here's two brighter days ahead. Entry by owner Bowen Landegg. Okay. Urgent notice, oh dear. Facing the consequences. I can't believe it's come to this. We thought we were being clever, blaming Lambeth Brewery for our money-making scheme. Mixing raw sewage with water in the beer was a dis desperate attempt to keep Bishop's Tower alive amidst the war and rationing. But now, an of official inspector has uncovered the truth. We've received a summons to court, and they're slapping us with a hefty fine. It's in the thousands, money we don't have. It's a dark day for the pub, and I can't escape the guilt of our actions. The pub's reputation is tarnished, and our loyal patrons are betrayed. I don't know what the future holds for the bishop's toe now. We have to face the consequences of our choices, no matter how desperate we were. Our reputation's shot, and I fear this might be the last entry for our beloved pub. Entry by owner Bowen Landeg. Well, you shouldn't be putting bloody sewage in your beer. That's just... Ugh, stinky. Gross. Vile. Awful. All right, let's go. Come on, Churchill. Rock and roll, buckaroo. We've got places to go, people to see, guns to nab, hooligans to do in. You know, the usual jazz. All right. So the police station. Excuse me. How? Okay. You suppose... Oh, God. It can. Holy... How the hell do we get up there? Churchill, can you see a way? Ain't personal, just you or me. It ain't personal, it's just you or me. How the hell did you get up there, dude? Let's, let's, how do we, well, there must be a way. Okay, let's go up here. Um, sir, would you care to share the means to get to your location? You missed, by the way. Really? Dip. Did I miss? Did I miss? All right. There we go. So. Do you know what? Do you know what? I, I have to know now. You know when you just have to know? Wellness scent. Um, I don't think whoever they belong to are, are particularly well. Let's be quite honest. Um, that's creepy. Okay. Oh! Hooligan scum. Okay, I don't know how you managed to get down here, but I am not going to complain. Hello? Anyone in? Look at this. Okay, Clarity Classic. Chem station. Oil canister. Looks like kind of a comfy bed, I'm not going to lie. But, Churchill, we've not time to sleep. Or perchance to dream. Good lord. File cabinet. Nothing else up here. Hello? Anyone around? In a word, no. Alright, do you know what? Screw it. After being so rudely interrupted, let's get on with it. Books, stationery, ugh. The days when you could just read, read a, read a book. Is that what I th think it is? Fusion cell. Okay, yeah, this is one of these naval walker things. Look at it. Jeez, how the hell are you supposed to defeat one of those? I mean, apparently, just 
throw a nuclear bomb at it, but, well, that doesn't really help our case. Fire extinguisher. Oh, I didn't really want the receipt, but never mind. Take it. Oh, Nuka-Cola. Stimpak, why not? Okay. Ooh, might be something useful in here. Oh. Curse it. There we go. Good guess. Hey, there's a safe. There's a lift as well. All right. Ooh. Oh, oh. Honestly, didn't expect that to work. Holy, first time. Look at that. Bam. I mean... Much of a haul, but never mind. Um, do you know what? Why not? Why Going not? Down. down. Oh. Okay. Churchill, you'll catch up, mate. Going up. Guessing this will take us up to the roof where that dude was. Maybe. Maybe. Oh. <sighs> Distraction Avenue. Oh. Hero. Whatever. Take it. Sell it. Yep. Yep. Take it's rounds and a whole heap of garbage. Anything else around here? Uh, ooh, Anarchy Times. You've collected an issue of Anarchy Times. Permanently gained better prices when buying from a vendor. Well, whoop de do basil. Brilliant. All right, let's go, Churchill. Let's get off this roof and get to the bloody police station and get these guns, because... Ooh, hello. Oh, too much to run. Do you know what? Do you know what? Do you know what? Had enough of this affair. Okay. Let's get to the cop shop. Or police station, if you want to call it that. That noise. Oh, God. Post boxes. What? Pinned... Pinhead bowling. Well, unique. I'll give you that. Mm. Okay. So... Pond. Not fancy in a swim, thanks. Yeah. Metropolitan Police! Here we go. Okay. Jesus. Okay. All right. All right. All right. All right. We need to just... We need to just... We need to back up. Take to the bushes. Churchill! Take to the bushes, puppy dog. They saw Churchill. They must have done. They can't see me. I was hidden in the bushes. Help. What? Okay. Hey. What the heck? Where the. Oh. There you go. I'm just getting started. So am I, love. There you go. Oh, shut up. Brilliant. Okay. Oh. Oh, there you are, are you? There you are. Now you're not. You'll run out of bullets eventually. I doubt it, mate. I've got nearly a thousand of the buggers. Where is this Egypt? Might as well learn. Um, I've done this hundreds of times. Have you? Think this will be any different? Uh, well, I mean, Churchill's on your case. Because he's such a good puppy dog. Ooh, I think I might have shot her in the derriere. Oh, I missed. Oh. oh, God, why did I just do that? That was really dumb. I didn't mean to do that. I mean, it. It did the job. It did the job. I'm not going to complain. It just, it did the job. So, screw it. Um, right. I need to, I need to do something. Do I not? Um, might as well eat all these pears. Get rid of them. 
It's just weight that we don't need to carry, isn't it? Um, hmm. Rad rat steak. Hmm. Tasty. Love it. Okay. Let's reload. Okay. Disappearing actor. Oh no. No, no, I'm still here. Don't you worry, mate. You're the one who's disappeared, apparently. You know. Are you on the roof? What are you doing on the roof? No sign of them now. Well, alright. Okay. Anyone else knocking about here? No. Huh. What is this? Some kind of garbage structure? Jeez. I think one of them is up there. Hmm. Oh! Thought oh, I saw somebody. Got me kind of worried. It was nothing, sir. Nothing for you to concern yourself about. Must be up there somewhere. Oh, idiot. What an idiot. I mean, is this... You know what? I don't need to know. Let's uh, let's go in, Churchill. Hopefully, we can just slip in and slip out. Okay. Shh, Churchill, are you Bucky? Hello, mate. Temptation is unbelievable. <sighs> Shh, Churchill, Churchill. What are you doing? Got to be an end to this someday. Mm. Until then, don't get caught. Hmm? Could I? Do you suppose? Slip over here. Hey, who's there? Apparently, yes. Okay, um, well, paid? No, um, bunk. Look at that. Protectron on duty. Okay, this interface should only be used by Robco licensed technicians. Well, tough taters. Personality mode. Uh, I mean, law enforcement? Would that be the one? Okay. Um. Then do we just set it off? Let's do it. Okay. Powering up. Run, Nick, run. On duty. Okay. Don't, 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 don't come for me. Or Churchill. Churchill. Oh God. Alright, well while he's doing that Or she, I suppose it could be a woman Female protectron Bucky's terminal, eh? Swine Oh god I got your back um you may now resume your normal activities. Well, Bucky, screw you, mate. I know I could have talked to him, but why bother? Dude's an idiot. Wow. Protectrons really don't mess about, do they? Oh, God almighty. Churchill. Come here. Just get out the way. Rounds, molotovs, yep. This was the best plan ever. I'm sorry, but it was. Just, just unbelievable. That's what we need, Churchill. We need a protectron. Come back. I 
was having fun. What are you even talking about, you weirdos? Okay. Yeah, I, I like this. This works. This absolutely works. For, oh, okay. I'm sure it will. The Protectron will find you. In the, whoa, okay. All right, dude. Can you? Could you? Could I? Could we? I can't believe they're only giving me half a share. Half a share of what? What? What are you talking about? Okay, tickets. Um. Where was I? Shut the fuck up for a second. That I is rude. Something. Ba -da, da 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 da. Thank you. Okay. Ooh, more tickets. What the hell was that? It's a wonderful thing called none your business. That's what's what it is. You guys got me stirred up over nothing. Oh well, shotgun shells, Molotov. Uh, okay. Anything else here? Tickets, tickets. Loads of t loads of tickets. Yes, thank you. Beautiful. Tickets, coffee cup, there. The yep. Was that? The protectron was a brilliant idea, Churchill. Absolutely brilliant. So that must be the way upstairs. Bah, getting shook up over nothing. Well, while we're down here... Okay, hello. Don't mind me, dude. You've done me a big favour there. Getting rid of all these Egypts. Like I say, Bucky. What an idiot. Bam. I know that was a waste of a bullet, but... He deserved it, Churchill. Every slap of the blooming bullet he got. Alright. Let's... Let's have a look, shall we? Uh, Bucky's plan. Okay. Right then, it's all coming together now. The best money-making scheme this side of the Thames. Gonna make a pretty penny from all those traders and settlers coming through Lewisham's gate, and they ain't got a clue what's in store for them. See, I'll tell them they've got to haul this bag, real heavy one, up to the top. Why, you ask? Well, I'll tell them it's part of some grand game, and if they don't play it, they'll get murdered by me, or what have you. Give the lads something to do, Keeps them entertained, innit? And I ain't stopping there. Oh, no. I'll promise them a big payout once it's all done. Real nice sum, too. Gets them all excited. Like they've got a shot at a fortune or something. Truth is, I'll never hand over a bloody ticket. Once they've knackered themselves out dragging that bag, even if they do somehow make it to the top, ain't gonna happen, I'll be long gone. Clever, eh? They do all the work, thinking they're onto some golden opportunity or risk death, and I walk away with pockets full while they've got nout but sore backs to show for it. Ain't no better way to make a quick quid than letting the fools think they're winning. By the time they realise, it'll be too late. Well, Bucky. My dear, unfortunately. Well, Mr Protectron ended you. Word on the street. Ah, yes. See, we've still got to meet Moneybag Sullivan, Churchill. Hmm. Bucky, okay. Listen up. Our ghoulie lad Bucky has been silenced for good. No more bets from this rogue. There you are. Okay, so... Who is Moneybag Sullivan? Can we... Here in a ruckus over at the Bank of England, seems that Moneybag Sullivan's wealth couldn't save them this time. They are gone. Oh. Violent Violet. Uh... Violent Violet Storm has been subsided, their rage now but a memory it seems. The first fury they once unleashed upon London has been calmed, leaving a silence that echoes their past wrath. Big loss this one, she'll be missed. I don't think she will. You know? I think she was probably just scum like the rest of them. Aha! Here we go. Oh, might there be something under here? No, probably not. Chill! Ooh. Uh, get a grip. Do you know what? Protectron on duty. Even though he's not. Okay. All these file cabinets. Every single bloody one empty. Jeez. Okay, I'm guessing somebody's in here. But, uh... I don't think I can hide, I know. And I didn't even attempt to. Okay, so, receptionist terminal, what? 
Surely we've already... what? K. Walliams. Oh, okay. Uh, sent coffee run. I'll be making the coffee run in 10 minutes, so if anyone else wants to add their order to this list of caffeine, let me know. And remember, no more than three sugars unless you want to incur the wrath of the vending machine, which has a mind of its own these days. Yeah. The Great Coffee Fiasco. Good morning, Lewisham's finest. We're starting the day with another coffee conundrum. I'm compiling the orders, and as usual, it's a blend of the bizarre and the downright ridiculous. Here's the rundown. Chief Inspector A. Boyd Carpenter, a triple shot of espresso with a splash of oat milk, two teaspoons of honey, and a sprinkle of cinnamon. He calls it the Thunderbolt, and insists it keeps him sharp. Personally, I think it sounds like a heart attack in a cup. I mean, yeah, maybe. It's honey. Honey's pretty good for you, but... Don't want too much of it. Sergeant Riley, black coffee, just black, no sugar, no cream. He says it puts hair on your chest, but I think it just puts a scowl on his face. Officer Patel, a caramel macchiato with extra caramel drizzle, a shot of vanilla and a dollop of whipped cream. He says it's for energy, but I'm pretty sure he just has a sweet tooth. The sugar high kicks in about halfway through his shift and he starts bouncing off the walls. Detective Evans, green tea, not coffee but it's worth mentioning because he insists it must be brewed for exactly 3 minutes and 42 seconds. Too short, and it's undrinkable. Too long, and it's ruined. The tea ritual is so precise, it's almost an art form. Officer Martin, decaf. Yes, you read that right, decaf. When asked why, Martin just shrugs and says, I like the taste. No one understands it, but we respect it. Sort of. I get that. Mysterious Muffin Incident. Okay. Today's entry is less about police work and more about the strange case of the missing muffins. I came in this morning to find the break room in uproar. Apparently, someone has been pilfering the blueberry muffins from our weekly pastry delivery. Here's the rundown. Chief Inspector A. Boyd Carpenter. Not pleased. He's been looking forward to those muffins all week. He's already planning an internal investigation, complete with suspect lists and interrogation sessions. I think he's half joking, but I've seen that look in his eyes before. Muffin justice is no laughing matter. Sergeant Riley claims he saw Officer Patel lurking suspiciously near the break room last night. Patel denies everything, but his alibi, I was checking the coffee machine for sabotage, sounds flimsy at best. The plot thickens. Detective Evans says this is all the hallmarks of an inside job. He's dusting the muffin tray for fingerprints as we speak. I didn't have the heart to tell him that Everyone touches the tray when they take a muffin. Officer Martin suggests it might be the work of the Muffin Man, a notorious prankster from his academy days. I'm pretty sure this is just a wild guess, but it's the most excitement we've had around here since the coffee machine incident of 76. Officer Patel, still claiming innocence, but offered to bake a fresh batch of muffins to make up for the lost ones. I'm not sure if this is a peace offering or a clever ruse to throw us off his trail. But yes, the muffin mystery is far from over. In the meantime, I'll be placing an extra large order at the bakery to keep everyone happy. And I'll keep an eye out to see if I can see anything suspicious, like crumbs on a uniform. And I'll report it immediately. Muffin theft is a serious offence in this police station. Well, I mean, yeah, I get that. I'd be annoyed. You know, if you're looking forward to your blueberry muffin of the morning. Now it was. Okay. Whew, uh, well... Ah, there's the weapons shipment. Is there anything else here of use for us? Another terminal. Chief Inspector's terminal, though. Yeah. Okay. Um, yeah. Rising crime rates. Okay. Uh... Crime rates in Lewisham have been on the rise over the past few months. We've seen an uptick in burglaries, assaults and vandalism. Our officers are stretched thin and resources are becoming increasingly scarce. I've requested additional support from Central Command, but with the current situation citywide, I'm not optimistic about a quick resolution. We need to strategise and prioritise our response. Community engagement and increased patrols in high-risk areas are essential. Let's keep our focus on protecting our citizens and maintaining order. Yep. New recruits and training. I am pleased to announce that we've welcomed a new batch of recruits to the Lewisham Police Station. These fresh faces bring much needed energy and support to our ranks. Their training programme will be rigorous, focusing on traditional 
policing skills and the latest crime fighting technologies. Our veteran officers will mentor the recruits, ensuring they are prepared for the challenges ahead. It is crucial we build a strong, cohesive team to tackle the rising crime in our area. Let's give them the support and guidance they need to succeed. Brilliant. Uh, incident at Lewisham High Street. Hmm. We've received an alarming report from Lewisham High Street. It appears that a group of individuals, possibly gang members, have infiltrated the department store and left threatening messages on their terminal systems and trashed the place. I've dispatched a team to investigate and secure the premises. Coordination with the department store's security and local authorities will be critical. This is a high priority situation and we must act swiftly to prevent any potential disaster. All officers are to remain on high alert until further notice. Mm. Okay. Coffee run. I'll be making the coffee run in 10 minutes, so if anyone else wants to add their order to the list for coffee of caffeine, let me know. And remember, no more than three sugars unless you want to incur the wrath of the vending machine, which is, has a mind of its own these days. Oh, well, we've already read that. Okay. What? Ooh, okay. Take the round. Thank you very much, sir. Terribly sorry you didn't make it, but, well, there you go, I suppose. That's life, isn't it? You know, bombs and all that. Damn. Alright, well, let's um, check out the rest of the place first, actually. Thank you. I'll find you. I don't think I know. Oh, God. Scared? You should be. No, never scared, love, never scared. Especially not of Egypt like you. Ugh. I mean, you could have at least cleaned the bloody that? toilets. God. Come on out. I'll make it nice and clear. So will I. Just nice. Again, don't think no. I'll find you. Oh, I'm sure you will. Whoop de doo da. Okay. Um. Yeah. No need to hide. It'll all be over soon. I'm sure it will, mate. Bloobs. Give me the bloobs. Hello. Oh, no. Goodbye. Oh, you're... You're... Okay. Hello. Oh, that's grim. Really? Bodies in the bloody boxes. Come on, now. Okay. Jesus. Good God! All right. The hell was that? That was me looting. Don't worry, I'll get to you in a minute. I'm just, um, you know, doing my thing. Plastic knife. This is bollocks. I don't think it's that, dear. All right. Busted up terminals. God. Okay. Take it. Hey. What was that? Just me again. Sorry. I'll be with you in a moment. In fact, I'm coming in now. Screw it. Open up! In the name of the law! Oh. Oh, hello! There you are! Um, could I... Could you... Maybe... Hello? Is... Is that someone stood at the end there? It was. Never mind. Shut the fuck up for a second. No, why I don't you? Something. God, so bloody rude. Jeez. Now come out wherever you are. No, shan't. Oh, there you go. When you turn up, you're oh, I'm sure. I'm sure, dear. But not as dead as you are. Just saying. So there's a turret. The oh. hell was that? Ugh. Show your face. It's tragic. Hello, Tell mate. You. Think you can hide for a run? Why they How did you say that when your head was blown off? Okay. Churchill, can I? Yep, thank you. What? Hello? Where the hell? 
Dude? Are you around here? Hello? Oh, hello. There you are, mate. Didn't mean to leave you out, you know. It just, just getting warmed happened. Up over here. here. So he hello? Is there anybody in? Oh. Sweets. Very nice. Think you can hide? I don't think I can hide. I'm just... Churchill, what the hell are you doing? Okay. Jesus. Alright. Yep. Kablam! Killed it. There we are. Churchill! What on earth is going on, puppy dog? Where are you? Where are you? Shush. It's alright. It's alright. There you go. Okay. You're alright. No harm, no foul. Okay. Tickets. Okay. Anything else? Dead body. All right, there is a terminal that we will potentially have to have a look in, but let's... Is it... Okay, this terminal? Zone ends terminal. <laughs> uh... Ethan? No. Likeness one. Uh... Stuck. Perfect. Need new weapons. Surviving the challenge of leadership. Word on the street. Okay, need new weapons. These guns we got now, rubbish. Jam up half the time, and when they do fire, they're about as accurate as a blind dog chasing its tail. We need new weapons. Proper ones. But of course, that costs money, and we ain't exactly flush with it right now. I've got Bucky coming up with a something for us. Gonna hopefully bring in some good deal of tickets. Some good deal of tickets? What kind of English is that? Might have to raid one of them arms convoys we've heard about. Risky, sure, but what choice do we get? Can't go into a fight with the pea shooters and expect to come out alive. We need something that'll put the fear of God in them. Okay. Surviving a challenge of leadership. Ooh. Bucky. He's a smart one, I'll give him that. He's managed to work out a way for us to get money by trapping and tricking the scavers who walk through the gate. But Bucky's been stirring the pot lately. Thinks he's got what it takes to run things better than me. Bloody cheek of it! But I know the game better. He'll challenge me soon enough, reckoning he can take the top spot. Won't be the first time I've put, had to put some young upstart in his place. I'll have to deal with him, but I'll do it smart. Make an example of him in front of the others. But without making a mess of things. Can't have them thinking I'm weak. But I also can't have them thinking I'm a tyrant. Fine line to walk, innit? Maybe I can force Bucky to play his own game. Ha! Yes, indeed. Uh, rebuilding my reputation. Okay. The Zone End name used to mean something. Traders from all over would flee from the sight of me, knowing they'd get something messed up if they didn't. My own gang used to quake when I'd walk into a room. But after all the scams and dodgy deals Bucky has done, I've lost that trust in the gang. I'm not even sure I'm in charge anymore. Now the guys come in, look around, and walk right back out. I think I might have lost to that swindler Bucky after all. I've been thinking maybe it's time to clean up my act a bit. Just for a while, I saw some Camden gun runners dotted about. I think I could do a smash and grab on my own and get a few real supplies in. Make the lads think I've turned a new leaf. Once I've built up the trust again, then I can deal with Bucky, take over his scams and start fleecing London proper. That'll do it. I'm playing the long game. Hmm. Back in business. It blood worked! I've just got a massive restock of guns. Proper beauties too. The gang know I'm back in charge now, no questions asked. It's all running smooth again, just like it should be. As for Bucky, I've relegated him to running gate scams. 
Figured that's where his talents are best used. He's the midpoint now, dealing with the lot, the lot over at the construction site and keeping things in check between my crew here. He'll scam anyone coming through, keep him busy while we at, at this cop shop handle the real work. All back in order, just the way I like it. Okay. We're on the street. Oh, it's just this again. Okay. Well, all right. So, okay. Do we need to use this other terminal to get in? Churchill? Maybe. Okay. Let's have a look. Uh, unlock door. Just guessing. Um, I don't know how this is going to go, Churchill. So let's just um, be cautious. Hello? Who are you? Okay, yep. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Sounds like there's a lot of um No need fucking hiding from me. You're dead. I didn't hide from you. You hid from me. Okay, Jesus, what the hell is she shooting me with? Um Do you know what? Why not? Okay. Churchill! Whoa! Holy fuck I'm only what the hell? Is she coming? Can we shoot her through here instead? Hello! Goodbye! Churchill, let me through, please. Thank you, my dear. Alright. Um. <clears throat> Tickets, rounds, frag grenade. Do you know what? I I I don't need to open any of these, do I? Just yeah, don't need to open a single one of them. What the hell? Power box? I'm not activating the bloody oh. <sighs> okay, so <clears throat> can I? Could I? I suppose. No. <clears throat> well, that, that, that is just bad news bears, isn't it? Oh, I want the loot, Churchill, but, but, but. I don't want to deal with the ghouls. <sighs> and there are a lot of them. Ugh, ugh. Do I have any, um... <sighs> I do have frag grenades. Shame I haven't got any mines. Oh, God, there could be something really good in there. Can I just... Oh. Oh, Churchill, we all know what I'm going to do. We all know I'm going to have to do it, don't we? Do you know what? Maybe we could... Should we? Should I just let it go? But it's so big. And there's probably knack all in it. What do you reckon? Well, I, mm, I'm just a glutton for punishment, Churchill. 